ya, dan Tokyo on the net, okay. The double token, or dirt, yeah, I still have password on the team rocket now. Well, I know about passwords now too, you selfish vultures. Dr. Liliana. For the ground floor. Tom should be able to handle that. Bite. Easy for the Tom. What? I lost? You sure did. Okay, let's open up the door. And there we are. Hold it right there. We can't have a brat like you on the loose. It's hard not to team up, it's bright, you see. And I'm strange you may be, you can't take both of us at the same time. Sorry, baby. Now get ready to be thrashed. Oh yeah, it's me that's gonna be doing the thrashing. Hey, don't be so selfish. Spread the fun around. What? You had an accomplice? Where's your sense of honor? Where's your sense of honor, you vultures? As the interim boss in place of Giovanni, I'll show you how wrong it is to meddle with Team Rocket. Here we go, guys, the big battle against Dr. Crystal is about to begin. Our first Pokemon in Goldeen. A bit anticlimactic there, actually, with your first Pokemon. Bite. Easy for Tom. Getting close to another level up as well. Next up. Snorlax. I'll give this one for Ali. No chances. So you got magic on your team, eh? I'm afraid if that's not gonna be enough to stop me. Although it could take a while. It is a beast after all. Yeah. Let's use Surf, hopefully that might be a bit better. Getting closer. Off. Yeah, I was a little worried that he was going to use rest at some point there. Next up, a Dragon Knight. Ally can handle that. So, I'll give you that, you've got one health a team. Despite the opening Pokemon being a bit of a letdown. I don't have to use my strongest Pokemon in the end. And she's getting close to another level up. Dr. Crystal defeated. You really are strong. It's too bad if you were to join Team Rocket, you can become an executive. This hideout is done for, but that's fine. The broadcast experiment was a total success. It doesn't matter what happens to this hideout now. We have much bigger plans. We'll come to appreciate Team Rocket's true power soon enough. Enjoy yourself while you can. Foo 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 foo. And the selfish fortress is blasting off again. That did it. We defeated all the rockets here, but I'm concerned about the young guy I have battled in the process. Sorry, Vitaka. I saw how well you were doing, so I just hung back. Now all there is left to do is to turn off that odd radio signal. Is 
this machine that's causing all the problems. I don't see a switch in it. We have no choice. We have to make of the electrode faint. That should stop this machine from transmitting that strange signal. It's not no fault of the Pokemon, so it makes me feel guilty. Metapa, let's split the job. Yeah, okay. First one. all these guys a few times, so first up is a Hootoot. Not sure if it's gonna be Hootoot every time, but let's see what happens. Might put Tom back to the front of the party, actually. Especially if it is gonna be Hootoot every time. Not Tom, Ethan. Lack of concentration though, because Tom was already at the front of the party. Let's put Ethan. Next up. Oh, that's a, yeah, it is different. Okay, that actually surprised me. I was expecting to see only who toots every time. Never mind. Extra experience points for Ethan. And in the final one. A single quill. Okay. Actually I kinda of wanna capture that you know. So I'll I'll be right back guys, I'm gonna try and capture it. We've managed to capture this Cyndaquil, well, and it's actually quite tricky to, to capture as well, I have to say. But Cyndaquil will actually be quite useful for our team, especially as we don't really have a Fire-type Pokemon. So, it's a female Cyndaquil, so I'm going to name her. I wonder what she will name her, guys. I'm gonna name her... Kim. Kim the Cyndaquil. A new team member has now joined. That generally surprised me, I have to say. Right, that odd signal has finally stopped. The leg should be back to normal. You're the hero. Let me thank you on behalf of all the Pokemon. Oh yes, you should take this. I found it here, but I don't have any need for it. Ooh. I'll come in handy. That's Whirlpool. Teach it to a Pokemon to get across wild water. But keep this in mind. You can use Use that out of battle only with the badge from Mahogany Gym. Pitalga, the journey to becoming the Pokemon Master is long and difficult. Knowing that you'll keep... Will you keep going? I see. No, you're right. If you will give up that easily, you would have never chased that dream in the first place. I look forward to seeing you again. I wonder when that will be, guys. So in that case, it's time to leave the hideout. No, it's not this way, is it? Well, that's actually not the right way, it seems. So, it's over here. Before I use, use that teleport, let's see if there's any items left, which there were. An iron, that will come in handy. Anything else over here? Another item. A bit of barrier. I'll just toss something just so we can pick it up. Oh, let's use the solder pop actually. Let's let's heal Kim back up. Why not? Anything else? Probably not. I think we've explored everything else from here. So let's leave the 
hideout. The vultures have now left. So let's go to the Pokemon Center. You are about to need to full health. to the Pokemon Gym, which is now free. So in the next episode we're gonna take on the gym, but before we wrap up, let's check out Kim. See how strong she is. And what more she knows? Leah, Smokescreen, Ember and Quick Attack. Not bad. So if you guys enjoyed this let's play, please like, comment and subscribe to the channel. So in the next episode we're gonna take on the gym. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.